Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and this is our daily angelic message. If you are new here and you like what you're seeing, thank you for sharing, liking, subscribing, all of that. That helps me out a ton and it gets the message out to other people. So again, thank you for that. If you want to work with me, you have two options. You can book a reading through angelsouls444.com. Those are my standard readings. You'll read a description there on the site uh, or you'll see the description there on the site. Or if you want to work with me, for a live reading or one-on-one -on -one teaching sessions. I teach angel mediumship, how to connect with your angels. Uh, we can go through a session of directly connecting and working with various archangels. Email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com. And as of the re recording of this, I still have uh, some spots open this week. So if you want to get in fast, let me know. That would be for the live offerings. All right. So for today, we have Take Back Your Power. Archangel Raziel. So Raziel helps you see what is possible. Raziel can pop up when you think all is lost and then suddenly there's movement forward. So he does get associated with abundance and prosperity as well, but uh, in manifestation, but I mostly see him as coming and helping you see what you've been missing, right? So this is the type of thing, if you haven't been believing in yourself, you think you're no good at your art or your job or whatever it is, helps you see what you're doing right. Okay, so use your God-given power and intentions to manifest blessings in your life. So taking back your power is not about being egotistical and trying to convince people that you're good. It's about loving what you're doing. That's what he helps you see. Love what you're doing, right? Love what you're, what you're engaging in. If you don't love the people that you're around, if they harm you, if they take your energy, you take your power back. You go no contact if that's appropriate right? This is very much an evaluation day and it might be sparked because you see the potential of a blessing coming in, but it just starts to pass you by and you're like, hang on a second. I, I know what I need to let go of, or I know what I need to transform. And then you'll see that that blessing starts coming back to you. All right. We'll leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.